Hey everyone, welcome to another charging review, a charging brick review. Uh, this time I am going to review the 45 watt uh, PD USB C to C uh, charging bricks. Um, I already did a review on the 20 watt original anchor compact one as well um, and then I moved up and I did the review on the similarly sized Nano 2 30 watt and also a review on the Ojai which is pretty much the same form factor 30 watt uh, compact uh, PD charger as well. So now we're going to look at three 45 watt charger. So I initially went with, well, actually, I was gifted the Samsung um, 45 watt charger. Um, a long time ago and at that time it was great because it was able to somewhat fast charge um, my laptops as well but the size is pretty quirky so if you have power outlets that are vertical it's not an issue but if it's horizontal if it plugs in horizontal, it's going to take up two ports. So not very much an ideal one. The 45 watt um, insignia that I have here is uh, pretty compact. I think this is the Best Buy brand. Insignia is the Best Buy brand. And it does have uh, foldable prongs on here but the one that I uh, choose is the anchor 45 watt nano charger and all of these have specifications output specifications let's see here 5 volt 3 amps 9 volts 3 amps 15 volts 3 amps and 20 volts at 2.25 amps so the 15 volts at 3 amps that's what uh, differs from the 30 watt chargers is that extra power so it could power um, larger devices so but i choose it because you compare it to the size it's a slightly more compact and shorter than the Insignia. And with the prongs out, and you could even tell how much more compact the anchor is. So I'm probably going to have to end up retiring this uh, Samsung one and uh, start using um, the Insignia one for my work laptop. And then this one's going to be for my personal laptop, which is the Surface, the Microsoft Surface Book with the uh, with the adapter, the proprietary adapter that needs the five volts, three amps. Um, and plus, uh, this would be slightly more useful, especially if you have a, if you're using a um, cord, a C to C cord that has uh, different adapters to it. That way, 
I could have this hooked up with charging my laptop and then also charging my wireless mouse that is uh, micro USB and um, and also possibly charging my phone um, which is another USB port uh, USB-C port as well and uh, since this has a good output at 15 um, volts I think it should be able to suffice powering it even though it has one port um, let's double check on here so 5 volts 3 amps 9 volts 3 amps uh, 15 volts 3 amps and 20 volts 2.25 so very similar specs nothing wrong with this one um, as, it's just I prefer the more compact size of the Nano 2 but definitely I'm going to use this for work and I'm going to retire this one alright guys thanks for watching see you next time